Hello, my name is Monique, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. If you are subscribed, welcome back. Um, I got my um, April TBR for you guys. I am in... Hello. Um, I'm in nine buddy reads in April until June. So... My stack is a little bit large this this time. So let me get started and show you what I'm gonna be reading for April. And all the way through June. First book, The In Inheritance Trilogy by N. K. Jemison. Um, I'm doing a buddy read with a reader in time um, she did uh, opened a um, a good reads um, buddy read we're going to be reading this all the uh, from April we're going to be reading I got the tabs already on them I don't know if y'all can see that um, but we're going to be reading the first one in April which is Three hundred and eighty eight pages and it is called the Thou the Hundred Thousand Kingdoms. That's the first one we're reading in April and I can't wait to buddy read this with her. Sorry about that guys. Um but um I'm reading this with uh, a uh, readers reader in time. Um I don't know her name. I'll have to get it. But I will leave her link down below. But like I said, we will be reading... We'll be reading this thick book. This big bad boy. There is... There's 1,442 pages in this book. So we're going to be on it for three months. Uh, April, May, and June. And um, in April, we're going to be reading... Uh, a, a Hundred Thousand Kingdoms. Book one of the Inheritance Trilogy. This is how much we're reading for April, which is 388 pages. The next one we'll be reading is uh, The Broken Kingdom. This is book two of the uh, Inheritance Trilogy. We'll be reading that in um, May. And it's 772 pages. And then the third one the Kingdom of Gods, and we'll be reading that in June. Uh, and it is um, hang on a second. This is over 400 pages in June. It's 1,324. And then we got The Awakening Kingdom, a sequel novella to the Inheritance Trilogy. Um, we're going to be reading that in June. So, uh, um, so this will be June. So, I've had this on my TBR for over two years, and I've not picked it up, but now I get the time to pick it up, because I got somebody to actually read it with, that I can gush and, and do everything with it, so I can't wait to start it, 
We start this April 1st. Um, I'm going to show you, hang on just a second, I'm going to show you, um, the books that I will be buddy reading, um, uh, I got two e-books that I'm buddy reading, uh, the first one, it's on my Libby, from my library, and, It's called uh, Stopping Jack the Ripper by Karen Asasio. I'm buddy reading this on um, Mel's uh, Patreon. This is a buddy read for April, and I can't wait to start it. Uh, I got a hold on it, so it'll be ready by April 1st, and I can't wait to start it. I'm so excited. When I, uh, all the, uh, buddy reads I'm doing and all the channels I'm, I'm mentioning in my video, I will link down below all the channels and, um, the Discord and, um, and the Goodreads, uh, buddy read that I'm doing. And I will link Mel's channel, but that's the one we're reading for April 1st. The next one. That I am buddy reading on um, Tina's channel. Um, she's doing a buddy read on our Discord channel, um, and it is the Six of Crows by Lee Bardugo. I have not read this, but I've heard good things about it. It says six dangerous outcasts, one impossible heist. So I am really excited to start this, and I'm, uh, I will leave Tina's channel link down below and her uh, Discord channel if y'all want to join us in April. It's going to be fun. That's the two that I'm reading on my, on my e, e, la, 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 on my e-books. Uh, now let me show you the other buddy reads that I'm in. The next one. The Push by Ashley Austin, I think is her name. Um, me and Sarah, um, Sarah Shells, is reading this in April, April 1st, the first week of April. We're reading this together as a buddy read. And um, all I know is an intense page turner uh, drama about making and breaking of a family. And a, a woman who experienced motherhood is nothing at all like what she hoped for and everything she feared so it sounds pretty good it's supposed to be a thriller so i can't wait this is my book of the month for a uh for march so i can pick this up next month with sarah and i am so excited and i will leave her link down below as well the next buddy read uh i'm doing this on mike's channel um Mike's book review. Um, Annie's got a Discord for this, so I will leave both of those down below. Um, but he started uh, the Malazan in January. We're doing this for two years. Um, and this is the third book we're on. We're reading it for April and May. So we're going to be on this book for two months. Um, this is the third book in the, um, the Malazan book of the falling um i'm really excited to find out because i was really confused on the ending of book number two dead house gates so i'm really excited to find out what's all the hype and this book is uh, 913 pages so 
That's why we're going to be on it for two months. So it's going to be a while. And this book is the one me and Sarah is going to be reading. I forgot to tell y'all. Is 303 pages. So I won't. Uh, it won't take me long to read this. read this. I don't know about Sarah. I don't know her pace yet. But I'll find out. And she can let me know. The next one I'm buddy reading. Uh, Mad Ship. The uh, Live Ship. Traders Trilogy. This is book number two in Robin Robin Hunt. Uh, I'm buddy reading this on Megan's channel. Uh, we read um, what was the first one? Uh, we read uh, Ship of Magic in March. This is April and May. We're reading uh, Destiny uh, Ship of Destiny. So this is the one we're picking up in. Um, this is the one we're picking up in April. Um, I'm really excited because I really enjoyed book number one. I gave it a five stars, and I did a but a, a book review on that, which which should be coming up really soon on my channel. Sorry about that, but um, I'm doing this on Megan's channel. Uh, I will leave her link down below, and she has a Discord that we go and talk about these books. But like I said, I did Ship of Magic, and I did a book review on it, which should be coming up this week on my channel. Um, and I'm really enjoying it. I love the ending on Ship of Magic, and it left kind of a cliffhanger. And I'm, I'm excited to find out what happens next. And this book is... eight hundred and fifty pages so I don't know if I'm gonna get this done in April because I got so many buddy reads but I'm gonna try because I'm trying to keep up with all of my buddy reads um, but we'll see the next one I buddy read buddy reading with Melissa on curly top curly tops channel uh, we're doing a buddy read. Uh, we already read um, uh, the Rage of Dragons uh, in uh, in March, um, and I really enjoyed it. It, it was a, it was a page turner. I I really enjoyed it, and I will be doing a book review on that, and it will be on my channel soon. Uh, but we're buddy reading this. I will leave her channel link down below, so y'all be able to go check her out. She does great content. Um, but um, we're doing a buddy read on this. Uh, I don't know how many pages we're doing yet. I'll find out. I need to ask her about that. And I'll, I will keep y'all up to date on it. But it says, family is duty. Magic is power. Honor is everything. And this is by Fonda Lee. And apparently there's book number two, uh, J. War. Uh... I don't know if she wants to read, buddy read both of those with me too. And then uh, Rage of Dragons, there's a, a Venge of Dra uh, Fire of Vengeance, which I'm going to ask her if she wants to do a buddy read on that one when I talk to her. But uh, this book is 495 pages, so... We shall see. I got it. I got a. I got a, a lot of thicky books this month. A lot of them. The next one. Days of Blood and Starlight. This is book number two in the uh, Daughter of Smoking Bones, which I started last month in March. Uh, I think we're on this for three months. This is April and the Amaze uh, Gods of Monsters. Um, it says, Once upon a time, an angel and a devil fell in love and dare 
to imagine a world free of bloodshed and war. This is not that world. And I can't wait to see what happens next. Because I'm so excited. And I love this these covers. They're so pretty. It's by Lenny Tar uh, Taylor. Um, but we're on book number two for a uh, April. And I can't wait to see what happens. And this book is... Five hundred and twenty-five pages, and I love the maps that are in them. They're gorgeous. But uh, I'm doing a buddy read on this. Um, it's going to be on Twitter. Um, I think it's uh, Daughters of Smoking Bones tri um, uh, trilogy. I think is what we're, we're uh, doing the. Um, comments and our opinions about it. We'll see. The last buddy read I'm doing. Uh, Magnus Chase and the Gods of Arkin. This, uh, the Hammer of Thorn. This is book number two in the uh, Magnus Chase series by Rick Ryer. Um, I'm, I really enjoyed the first one and I did a book review on it and it should be up sometime in this week uh, but I'm doing a buddy read with my friend on the Twitter and we ch uh, chat and uh, chat about it on, on uh, messaging and give us each other our thoughts and I can't wait to see what happens in this and this book is Four hundred and fifty nine pages. So this will be a chunker. Chunk, chunk, chunk. All of my books are chunks this month, except for maybe one, and that is the push. It's only three hundred. The rest of them go with four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten over a thousand pages so I really got my ha hands worked out for this month um, but if I finish all these all my buddy reads I'm throwing in the last one uh, Sarah J Mass uh, Catwoman I've heard a lot of good things about this and I'm hoping that she she delivers because I'm reading Crescent City right now and I'm almost done with it and I'm enjoying it. And I've already did um, Avatar's uh, series. I did a uh, reading vlog which is already up on my channel. Y'all should go check it out. And I'm going to do a book review on this book uh, from Cindy which I will leave her link down below too. And thank her for recommending me this book because I'm really, really enjoying it. But, um, this one is This one's 360 pages. So, no, I'm sorry. 358 pages to be exact. So I got my hands like really full this month. And I can't wait to to start it. I, I'm so excited. Um, sorry about that. Um, all together out of 10 books I am reading 5,700 74 pages in 31 days. That's a lot. Um, we'll see. Because I read 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11.
I read 13 so far in March, and March ain't even over, but we'll see. I may succeed. 5,774 don't seem that bad. I might be able to get through them. So, we'll see. But this is... That's my page count. Five thousand seven hundred seventy-four pages. So that's a lot. Um, we'll see. Just wish me luck, guys. Uh, I always overstack my TBR, but I always manage to get through them. So we'll see. Um, yeah, I'm in for a ride. I already see it. I'm just. <laughs> I overdid myself again again so but I overdid myself yet again so hey like I always say go big or go home right so I got two ebooks and I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. and eight physical books on my TBR for April. Go big or go home, right? Um. <clears throat> Hello. Um. I wanted to put in this video uh, that um, I joined another buddy read. I read along um, the the strange the dreamer and um, immune immune of nightmares a, a, immune of nightmares um, they're doing a read along on on um, uh, on Twitter and I decided to jump in on it so now I'm in ten read alongs for April. So, my stack just got bigger. Um, let me show you the book. I'm going to be reading it on ebook. On my uh, um, Kindle. Strange the Dreamer. We're starting this April 1st. And we're doing... Um, And we're doing that one in May. So I'm going to be on that for two months. April and May. So I can't wait to start it. Because I've heard good things about this. Um, I'm already reading. Already reading her. Um, Daughter of Spoken Bones. Um, trilogy. I'm on book two. The Days. Um. The Days of Blood and Starlight. We're reading that in April as well. So I'm going to be reading two of her books in the, in April. Um, it's going to be this one, which is the second book in the um, Daughter of Smoke and Bones. And we are reading... Strange the Dreamer. So I'm going to be reading. Oh, one, two, four, six, seven, eight. So I've got two of Lenny Taylor's uh, books that I'll be reading in April Dark Spoken Bones trilogy. And, and now, um, Strange the Dreamer series. So, I will be, I'll be on Lynn Taylor's, uh, books for five months. So, um, I'm really excited to do these. Um, I, I can't wait to start them. Which I've already started about the the daughter of smoking bones. I, I started that in um, 
March. So April we're reading the second one, and May we're reading the third one, and then April we're reading Strange to Dreamer, and in May we're reading Assume the Dreamer, I think it is. Assume the dream, Dreamer, which is book two in the uh, Strange the Dreamer series. So, altogether, I will be reading five ebooks and And eight physical books on my TBR. So, with that said, so my page read for the month of April is 6,307 pages to do for April. That's a lot. But I think I can do it. So, um, we'll see. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, uh, subscribe, and hit the bell button to be notified every time I upload, and I will see y'all in my next video, and happy reading. Bye!